Well, the rock soar uh, underneath is basically unchanged, and we've done a lot of uh, research with owners, and they love everything about the vehicle. It's steel body, steel frame, the turbo diesel engine, and all of the ruggedness and capability that comes with that. So we, we didn't, haven't changed any of that. What we've changed is uh, primarily the front end. Um, what we've researched is that people love its ruggedness. They love to work with this vehicle. And so we wanted a front end that, that had that toughness and ruggedness. We've integrated with our tractor division, so it's got a bit more of a tractor feel. That's what we were going for from a design standpoint. The area under the uh, under the wheel, there's there's no fender. You know what we've heard from people is that when you're on a ranch or when you're on a farm, you're working with the vehicle in all kinds of conditions, mud, rocks, uh, brush that can all get trapped in here. So the, the redesign's got a a functional uh, benefit too in terms of you know you're not going to get that kind of stuff. Uh, clogged up between the wheel and the fender. So that was part of what informed the, uh, the the design approach we took for it. But it was primarily to give it a stronger, more rugged, more aggressive, more workmanlike uh, attitude. That's the, that's the direction we gave it design. It's shipping now. Uh, the first dealers arrived, uh, first rock stores arrived at dealerships a couple of days ago. Um, there are 71 dealers in our, in our phase one distribution plan spread out all across the uh, country and then we'll start scaling up uh, from there as, as we head into 2022. Yeah, we, we've done terrifically well in the recreational segment, rock crawlers, you know, people that, you know, are going out on the trails, uh, hunters. And we've equally done well with, with farmers and ranchers and rural lifestylers. There's a huge trend uh, of people moving out of the major cities, buying property, you know, moving into more of a rural lifestyle, and they need vehicles they can work with to, to manage their properties. And so uh, this vehicle, because of its superior durability and capability to, to the whole segment of side-by-sides, is proving to be very popular. It lasts a lot longer, it's got more capability, it tows significantly more than what the side-by-sides can do. Those are plastic body vehicles with CVT, CVT uh, belt-driven uh, transmissions. Steel body, steel frame, 2.5 liter turbo diesel engine. It's built to work and it's built to last and people are recognizing it.